Senator John Cornyn, the TxDOT chairman, and local officials meeting in McAllen to discuss the Valley's transportation and infrastructure needs. Our Rocio Villalobos tells us how officials are working on improvements to reduce the devastation of future storms. After the Texas Senator's visit to the RGV last month by invitation of Hidalgo County Judge Richard Cortez, he returns today with the TxDOT chairman to discuss the region's challenges in regards to flood control and to seek solutions. The senator met with Chairman Bruce Bug Jr., Judge Cortez, and other local officials involved in the RGV's Metropolitan Planning Organization, which was established earlier this year when the MPOs of Brownsville, Harlingen San Benito, and Hidalgo merged. The RGV is truly speaking with one voice, and that is very important from a state of Texas standpoint, so that we know that there is one united voice. Between 2018 and 2019, the RGV experienced two 500-year floods, and while TxDOT is responsible only for transportation and infrastructure funding, Bugs says when it comes to highways preventing water from reaching the other side, TxDOT will take action. We do not have responsibility for drainage and flood control generally. We do have a responsibility to make sure that our engineering and the way we have built and constructed uh, our infrastructure does move the water from one side to the other. He adds TxDOT will be looking into the matter to determine whether to designate a portion of the funding to projects aiding flood control. If it is our responsibility, we'll stand tall and stand behind it. Over the next 20 years, the valley is expected to double in population, as Senator Cornyn says that along with the upsides of its growth come downsides. We're sort of, uh, we're sort of victims of our own success. People are moving to the valley, the valley's growing, creating jobs and opportunities. And that means more people and less places for the water uh, to go. Senator Cornyn adds he is committed to working with local leadership to resolve the Valley's infrastructure needs. In the McAllen Newsroom for Local 23 News, Rocio Villalobos. TxDOT's Transportation Commission recently approved a $2.1 billion budget over the next 10 years for the Valley's TxDOT district.